Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Vera Corosidis and I'm a postdoctoral fellow and palynologist at the Smithsonian Institution. A palynologist is a scientist that studies fossil or modern spores and pollen that are produced by plants. Because the pollen is so important to the future of the plant, it is created out of an incredibly hard substance that means it can be preserved in rocks for hundreds of millions of years. Every plant that has ever grown on Earth produces a morphologically distinct pollen grain. So as palynologists, we can compare pollen produced by modern trees to what we see in the fossil record. And so, if we find a fossil pollen grain that resembles a modern pollen grain, we can be confident they were both produced by the same type of plant. As part of my postdoctoral research here at the Smithsonian Institution, I've been using the Paleobotanical Collection and examining rocks collected from Wyoming that are 56 million years old. I have found pollen produced by palm and also dawn redwoods in these rocks that are 56 million years old. And this suggests that the climate and environment of Wyoming used to be dominated by swamps and dry subtropical forests, which is very different to today. And this just demonstrates how we can use palynology to better understand ancient environments and ecosystems.